Don't you just wish you had more games with cute, cutesy characters and depressing backstories and look, guns! I have the perfect game for you. Introducing to you Honkai Star Rail, the perfect game to make you cry. We begin on a spaceship. came at a bad time. No, no. I think you couldn't have timed it better. We are introduced to Kafma, who was with some strange, mysterious organization who was trying to steal something from the lab. Cleaning up other people's mess isn't in my job description. You know, Kafka? We are introduced to Silver Wolf, associate of Kafka, and they are looking for something called the Stellaron. They make their way to the lab, which we learn is owned by Herta. But Herta is not the one who is currently in charge of it. It is run by the acting lead researcher. Through Silver Wolf's hacking, and we somehow get through the wall and find this weird glowy object that is called the Stellaron. The receptacle's ready. Your decision. Mm. Between the two vessels, I chose the girl and named her Pink Cat. There we go. How much does she remember? Hmm. I'll remember you. Time to get up. And then she acts like nothing ever happened. After getting no answers from her, we are quickly found by two travelers, who introduce themselves as Dang Hong, the one on the right, and March 7th, the one on the left. Then March explains that they are from the Astral Express and were stopping by when the attack happened. Hark. It's better if you have something to protect yourself. So I'm getting a weapon. I indeed got a weapon. We fight some of the purple creatures and meet a mechanic who was on the ship when the attack happened, and he said suspiciously that the system went down before the attack. Quite suspicious indeed. We take down a lot more creatures. And when the centaur looking one cornered us, Himiko saved us with her drone. Then we meet the acting lead researcher who tells us that there might be more monsters coming. I got scanned by the gotcha system again. And I help out some poor traumatized folks. Definitely has some PTSD. And like the researcher said, we are quickly attacked by a dragon looking thing. <laughs> Take the express and leave. I'll stay. But... Wait, march! Huh? Huh? Oh no. The doomsday beast. It's really here. Get down here! Uh, careful, everyone! And yes, the dragon attacks us. Was with me, Hoyo and dragons. I quickly won, but not before this happened. I'm 
was Lila. <sighs> what happened? What is the end of your story? Who is that? Reach the end of the story. <laughs> talk somewhere else then he walks away without saying anything else dong hung tells us they retreated and we exchange numbers then i meet herta a child who owns this lab able to achieve that with this little twerp's body but i'm still gonna call you little twerp this little twerp really has a temper. This little twerp can only stay temporarily. Keep worrying about this little twerp all the time. And then the best dialogue option shows up. Probably the most self-certain person I've ever met. Then the insulting child takes me back to her lab and tries to explain me the lore of this game. But I'm gonna be honest, none of it made sense. Finally, I decide to join the express. To get away from the child, of course. The I am then informed that the train is moving on to its next destination and I take a seat, ready for the next adventure. <laughs> <laughs> 